Hey, Tina Mickelson here with Georgia Hall, and I'm very excited we're going to be talking about this shot because so yeah. many amateurs get very nervous when you're trying to get the ball out of a bunker, but you've got a lip here, you've got to get the ball higher. So how do you handle this? Yeah, I mean, it's a tricky shot for sure, um, especially when the sand's like this, but I think the main thing is getting as much height as possible and uh, make a good connection and not, not hitting too much sand. I think that's, right. that's key. Right, so when you said sand like this, it's a little packed today. It's not super fluffy, and yeah. so that's another factor that comes into the equation. Yes, um, I think maybe it's slightly harder to get contact like this, um, to get it higher. So it's kind of, you know, mostly focusing on setup and, and how, how much speed you want through the ball. Kind of have the ball position, maybe three balls or two balls inside my left foot. Um, keeping, I've got a 58 here. So I want to keep the club face open uh, throughout the whole swing. Um, so for me, a good drill is just to have a bit of sand um, on your club face. And I want to try and keep it on the club face as far back as I can without it falling out. Even just to do a few of these, and I think if you can keep it there, and if you keep it even more, that's great. Like you're throwing it over your right shoulder. And then I just try and do the same thing throughout the ball. Um, open club face on the back swing, and then really keep it open on the forward swing, sliding underneath the ball. So I try and give a go. That. <laughs> I can see where it's so important to keep that club face open because you got beautiful height despite the fact that the sand is just a little because of the moisture this morning. Yeah. yeah. To make sure you keep the club face open yep. and, and accelerate. Yep. I, I see a lot of amateurs decel on the ball, so I think they're the two most important things for me. 